Hi, I'm Pamela Hack from Makeup Designery. Now I'm going to show you two more looks you can use with the same palette using our new model, Brandy. First I'm going to do a natural look using different colors from the palette than I did the first time. And then I'm going to show you a smoky eye. But first I'm going to apply some foundation. I'm using the 210 wedge brush to color in Brandy's eyebrows with graphite eyeshadow to bring more shape and definition to them. With the 330 brush, I load the pink grapefruit eye color on both sides and apply with a light sweeping motion from her lash line up over her lid to the crease area, adding more as I need to create the intensity that I want blending up toward the brow, making sure to lift the outer corner as I apply. Then I apply on the other eye to maintain balance. With my 210 brush, I use Espresso under the lower lash line to create a soft edge liner, blending slightly as I apply. Then I apply the same color at the upper lash line, starting at the outer corner creating a slightly wedge shape to create a subtle lift and bring all the way across to the inner corner. Then adding a small amount of espresso to the outer crease to extend subtly the lift I started at the lash line. Again, blending as I apply. Now I do the same on the other eye and check the other side to maintain balance. Now with an ordinary teaspoon that I have sanitized with alcohol, I curl her lashes by holding the spoon upside down in my right hand, her lashes resting on the pad of my right thumb, and by pressing the spoon against her lashes, sliding the spoon towards me, the heat caused by friction of the rubbing will curl her lashes. Loading a small fan brush, the number 500, with MUD's Black Volumizing Mascara, I carefully sweep it over and under Brandy's lashes for a soft full effect. Then with the 510 large fan brush, I sweep a light amount of rose beige to the apples of her cheeks. And that's our natural look. Yeah. Yeah.